We'll continue the conversation in Miami, the final team in the AFC East that we're grading today. And Charles Harris, outside linebacker help uh, in the first round. Bucky, you go down the rest of their board as well. Uh, Isaac Aziata, Isaiah Ford later on. Who's your favorite? Charles Harris. Charles Harris is mm -hmm. what they needed off the edge. Cam Wake is lonely out there. He's doing everything by himself. He's the only pass rusher in that. 35 years old, you need to find someone that can be a compliment. Everyone needs a playmate. Charles Harris is the perfect playmate for him. Quick, elusive, has a nice spin move to get inside. He's going to be a guy that quickly becomes a double-digit sack artist in Miami. Who is a surprise that might contribute right now? I'm a little surprised. Cordray Tankersley from Clemson going in the third round to the Dolphins. Just a little bit of surprise. This is a player who has the physical tools to be a really good player. He's tall. He's long. He can run a little bit. His biggest issue is he panics a little bit when the ball is in the air, and he can be a little handsy. He likes to grab a little bit. He will have to kind of learn or unlearn some of those bad habits that he picked up at Clemson because if he does that, he can be a pretty solid player. They have big expectations and high hopes for him. Let's see if he can live up to those. Yeah, uh, certainly uh, it's going to be interesting to see if this is a team that's capable of returning to the postseason. Can this draft help them given the grade you're about to give? Yeah, I'm going to give them a B plus. This is a really solid draft. I, I think they did some really good things. I like Raekwon McMillan coming in at inside linebacker. They're now solid at the second level. They fortified their front line with Charles Harris. This is a team that is ready to compete. It all hinges on the quarterback. Let's see if Ryan Tannehill can continue to live up to uh, – the flashes that we've seen. And I agree with all that. I think they got several guys that can contribute right now, just like the Falcons did last year. Not all stars, just guys that can come in and give you something. I think the Dolphins had a heck of a draft. Well, that is where the value in the draft is, and that does wrap up the AFC East.